In our first story, we're going to a place where you could probably find anything else you're looking for. We're going to Mississippi's largest flea market. It's in Ripley, Mississippi. First Monday trade day began in 1893, and it was held on the square. And it was the day that the sheriff would sell property that taxes had not been paid on. And of course, in those days, no women whatsoever were at it. And it was farmers trading horses and mules and livestock and things of that nature. Anyone who says men don't like to socialize, this is just not true. That was the whole reason First Monday started in the first place, with socialization and meeting with each other. But the women, they found out they had all these handmade items that they could swap for something else. And it was also a social outlet for them. They could get together and gossip. So it ended up on the Tippa County Fairgrounds, and uh, it was just not owned by anyone. There became, you know, some problems and things, and Mr. Wayne Wyndham saw the opportunity and he opened up area that he had, and that's where our first muddy is today. My dad took this over, or I say took it over, it was handed to him more than anything about 1974. So we're called First Monday Trade Days because since 1893, it was always on the first Monday of the month, so you can find the calendar, find the first Monday, and that was the day it was on. After we took over and increased it to a weekend size, then it became First Monday Weekend. So you find the first Monday and you look for the two days before it, and that's the two days that we have the market. Tomorrow we expect around 700 dealers to be here. I'm expecting 25,000 people this month to cover both Saturday and Sunday. So we're expecting a big weekend. Okay, so we need to find you a spot, and you're selling shoes, but you need a shoe. I've been coming up here since about 73, and the first time I came, we skipped college at, at Northwest and came, and I bought a case pocket knife and a gallon of molasses. <laughs> Well, there's a lot of things you can find here, you know, pets, if you like pets, or just about anything you can imagine, you will find it here. In the early days, it was dogs, they have fowls, chickens, peacocks, turkeys, and uh, just a wide variety of animals. I just don't know of anything that you can't find here. I come the first Monday about three or four times a year. Uh, my favorite thing about the market is people. We have people from Tennessee and different areas, so. It's a good wintertime job. Right now, it's a little warm. We have a lot of repeat customers. We have people that have been coming to this business for uh, over 30 years and buying our, our full time. I guess because it's tradition. I remember coming here when I was a kid. That's, that's what you did on the weekends. Everybody go to First Monday and it's well known. So people travel actually to come to First Monday. My favorite thing is, is that me, my husband, my brother, and my sister-in-law, Allison, we're all very close, and that we all get to work together, and, uh, you know, we feel like we've done something good. We work really hard, so at the end of the day, you know, we've been able to do that as a family, so that's just kind of nice. My favorite part about running it, I've just been involved with it forever. I don't know life without it. To me, it's like 
when the market's not here, it's just an abandoned shanty town. But on Saturday morning, it's a carnival. I mean, it's everything you could hope for and more. Thanks for joining us. If you like what you see, subscribe to Mississippi Public Broadcasting. Till next time, I'll be seeing you on Mississippi Roads.